Hi, welcome back to Educator.com, your introduction to music theory, and today's lesson will be on solfeggio, Italian. So, our lesson objectives are exploring and learning about all the different solfeggio syllables, and a little mini introduction to ear training, which is a really important part of music theory, your understanding of how the tones in a scale and in a piece relate to one another and where they're leading your ear and how you can reproduce musical tones on your own without a keyboard using solfege. So movable dough is what we'll be using. There's two kinds of solfege, fixed dough and movable dough. Fixed dough is when C is always dough, no matter what, no matter what scale you're playing or what key you're in, C is always dough. That can be a little complicated, so we're only going to focus on movable dough. Movable dough is when you have dough as the tonic note of every scale. Now you remember from our last lesson, the tonic note is the first note, the home key of the scale. So let's call up our keyboard. And as you remember, C scale, the first note of the C scale is the tonic note. The first note of any scale is Do when we're doing solfege. So movable Do, here's Do and C. So let's pretend like we're playing G. Now G is Do. This is Do. So Do will depend on the key you're playing in. Let's get back to C. So when we're doing ear training and solfege in music theory, um, we need to sing. So don't be embarrassed. It's really fun and do, do. singing. Even if you feel like you're tone deaf, try to find this tone and match it. If a lower tone helps, use a lower tone. But I really want you to try to find this tone. Sing it. Do. If this is the first time for you, don't feel embarrassed. It takes a while to get used to the sound of your own voice and to get used to the sound of singing a major scale, but it will come and it's really, really helpful when you're studying theory and understanding how the scale relates to itself. So let's find our C here. Here's C. Do. We just played that. Good. Okay. Re. Re is the supertonic. You're, you have a lot of fancy music theory knowledge now. You can call it the supertonic scale degree. Re. So using C, here's Do is C. Re is D. Also, if you know the movie The Sound of Music and you know the song Do a deer, a female deer, you know selfish. So let's go back to the keyboard and let's sing Re. And we'll sing it in relation to Do. Everything in solfege is easier when you relate the syllable back to Do. Here's our Do. Do. Here's D, the second scale degree, supertonic, Re. Re, Do, Re, Do, Do. If you have Do in your head, hmm. You can sing Ray without the keyboard. Ray do, Ray do, Ray do. Okay, easy. Moving on. 